As the Tamarack Fire continues to grow in Alpine County, a few ridgelines over, the community of South Lake Tahoe watches and remembers. The first thing I think of is Angora, because I was at Fallen Leaf Lake that day. We were there for like five minutes, me and my family, and we saw that huge smoke coming over the mountain. The wind-driven Angora fire in 2007 consumed more than 200 homes as the community watched in horror. Now, residents are quick to be concerned when they see smoke from a nearby fire. It's far enough away where we can, we can watch it closely and have some time to prepare if anything does change. Captain Kim George has been trying to ease the concerns of residents. She says the Tamarack fire is burning primarily in the opposite direction and not a threat to Tahoe at all right now. At the same time, we're asking people to think through the evacuation plan, like things that you might grab, have a list of um, the things you know that you're going to want to take if it does happen, um, a communication plan with your family, maybe meeting places. We anticipate it being exactly like this, gorgeous blue, wonderful air. Visitors have their concerns as well. Forest Suites Resort has most of their 119 units booked for the rest of the summer, but had some cancellations because of the fire. We did get a lot of calls because we got a lot of people that were concerned and wanted to know more about the fire and, uh, and about the smoke. Well, the skies are blue and the streets are busy. Right now, there's really no threat of evacuation, but of course the situation can always change. And there are some things you can do, whether you live here in Tahoe or plan on visiting this weekend, to make sure you're notified right away. So it's a good idea um, to sign up for the reverse 911 system. Um, it's a civic alert. You, it's found really easily on the El Dorado County website. The county's reverse 911 system found at ready.edso.org is the most accurate way for tourists and residents to receive notifications, including potential evacuation orders. At TahoeSouth.com, there's a Know Before You Go section and web camps if you want to check the smoke or get last-minute tips. But in the end... Yeah, common sense always prevails. The advice in Tahoe is don't be scared, just be smart and plan ahead in the event that the winds shift and the Tamarack Fire does become a bigger threat to this bustling community. In Tahoe, Kristen Samos, KCRA 3 News. Another resource you may want to consult if you're heading to South Lake Tahoe is the city website, which is cityofslt.com. It has fire updates, current burn restrictions and emergency information.